Hey, it's Vicki K, and I'm, you know, I'm trying to figure out all these different platforms and how to make my videos. I have to make one for Facebook, I have to make a shorter one for Instagram, and then YouTube, I can be a little bit more liberal on time and what I say, so um, bear with me because hopefully someday I can actually figure it all out. But right now, um, I'm just kind of trying to share my story. Yesterday, um, you may have seen where I had the anxiety attack because somebody called me. I actually answered the phone because I thought that it was going to be my old representative or the one that I'd had for several months. And she's very calm and I can understand what she says. And it wasn't, it was a new one. They keep changing my reps like every few months. So this person was talking very fast and I couldn't understand what she was saying. I didn't understand why she needed information that I had already sent to her. So my heart started pounding, my face got hot. I, I could like feel my head, like pressure in my head. Uh, your body begins to like hurt. Uh, it's the craziest thing. Um, I have not had anxiety attacks in the past. This has been simply from uh, a traumatic event that happened about three years ago, I think. It might have been two, but um, I try not to think about it because it really uh, affects me. So um, I don't want to really think back at that date as to what happened, but it was not good. And um, maybe someday I can tell you more about it. But for now, um, I've had a good day today. Uh, I just kind of went around commerce. Um, I saw, I sat with my mom for a long time and you know, the great thing about that, she's in a nursing home here in commerce and sitting with her and talking with her is just as good a therapy as for me as it is for her. And you know, she's my mom. She will always be my mom. And you know, she knows when to tell me what to do, you know, and I'm 54 years old and I, I still like, okay, mom, you know, and, um, I wish, you know, that I could just pick her up and bring her home and take care of her. But that situation is not a reality right now. So that upsets me, but, um, she's doing okay. She needs new teeth. They hurt the teeth that she has right now. They hurt her mouth and also a few other problems that she's having. She has vertigo real bad. Anyway, uh, wanted to thank you all for your kind comments about my anxiety attack and also about my journey. I never in my life thought that I would be sharing my journey in this way. Um, I did think that I would like maybe do a YouTube channel about traveling and having fun and uh, I don't know cooking and you know learning to cook things like that. I never in my life thought my YouTube channel would be about depression, anxiety, trauma, uh, work, place bullying. I never thought that I would be talking about this. And then for me to actually show and video and actually post me having an anxiety attack and me being depressed and crying, oh, uh, that never <laughs> did I think that would happen. And uh, the love and support that you've given me and the messages you've sent me have just really encouraged me to continue on this journey and to show people how real it really is and how important it is to be kind to each other, not only just in life, but at work. If, you know, you don't like someone that you work with or if they have different ideas than you do, still be kind. Don't don't bully, don't hate, don't ridicule, 
just show kindness, always show kindness. And I think that there's a lot can be said about just those, that one word with four little letters, kind, be kind to each other. And I think that a lot of the situations could be worked out without having to go through all the hate and without having to go through all the hurt and without having to put other people down and without having to stomp on the people who don't like that type of environment or that type of confrontation. You know, always show love and show support and show your kindness as a person. Okay, uh, I don't have a whole lot more on this tonight. I had a great day. As I said, I'm going to run Commerce. I actually, at the Sonic in Commerce, Texas, classic, two horses, uh, cowgirls on horses, you know, ordering their uh, drinks and tater tots or whatever they were having and then right in front of me the commerce police and you know it just it really made me smile so um, tomorrow I plan on going to uh, I'm hanging out with a friend from high school and college and life she's been with me oh my gosh just for as long as I can remember and she's been my best friend and uh, I know that life has happened kind of in in the middle of all of this and you know we raised our kids and we didn't live the same uh, place and so we didn't always get to talk you know Facebook didn't always exist and we didn't have cell phones all the time so um, yeah we're kind of uh, trying to get our groove back on that but yeah, I'm just going to, you know, tell you that I'm fine from the anxiety attack and tomorrow just show kindness, uh, even if you're at work and somebody's being a real turd, just tell them that they don't have to be that way and show kindness. Uh, walk away. You know, that I know that I tried that and it didn't work, but maybe if more people did that, well then you kind of take the power away from those who are bullies and hateful. Okay, I hope you're having a great night and I will see you tomorrow.